What is the best free MP4 to MP3 converter that works on Windows, Mac and Linux? If that is a question you've always had, in today's video, I'll give you that quick answer. Now, probably you've already used it and probably you don't know that this particular application has a feature to convert your videos to audio. So it's none other than the good old VLC media player. So you'll need to download VLC and it's a free and open source cross-platform multimedia player and it supports playing videos, watching videos and converting media from let's say video to mp3. So I've already downloaded and installed VLC and the good thing about VLC is that you can convert videos all at once that is multiple videos for example on screen I have three videos I can convert them all at once or I can just convert a single file if that is all that I wanted to convert. So Let's fire up VLC and I'll just search for it here. VLC media player. Now to convert our MP4 files to MP3 and here are my videos. These are all my videos and I'll change this view to details view. Let's click on that. So this, the type of the video is an MP4. We can see the size and the length. So let's go back to VLC and begin the process now. On your top left, there is media, click on that and then click on convert or save or press on control R. Click on that. And once you do that, you'll see a new dialog box to open media from file, disk, network or a capture device. We want to use the file selection option here and you can select local files with the following list and buttons. So click on add and we'll navigate to the folder with the files that we want to convert. As I've mentioned, you can either select one file or select multiple files. Now, to your bottom uh, right of this dialog, you'll see a number of other formats that you can actually import inside VLC and convert as well. And this includes 3GP, uh, AVIs, I believe it should have somewhere some other versions here that uh, TS, yeah, TS are, are common nowadays, especially for online streaming. So click on open and our files are going to populate inside this particular dialog box. Once we do that, uh, there's nothing else I'll change here. What I'll do is uh, from the convert or save, there's a drop down. Click on that. And once you click, there are four options. Enqueue, play, stream or convert. To convert, you can press on Alt plus O click on that and from this section you'll now get to uh, the settings for you to convert your file the source the source is multiple files selected and the type is a file or folder and then the settings you want to convert I will not tick anything here but the profile we want to use is audio mp3 there are a bunch of profiles inside here uh, including video formats uh, and audio formats and also even video for s for YouTube etc what we're interested in is audio mp3. Click on that. And from the gear icon on this side, you can also click on that to edit the selected profile. Now, from here, you can either choose a different profile if that is what you wanted to do. For example, a WAV, uh, if you wanted your file to be converted uh, into, a, into a WAV audio file, uh, you can check the video codec, but this doesn't apply in this case because we are converting an mp4 to mp3 you can check the audio codec and from this section you can change the different options that are available here uh, for the codecs and also change the bitrate and also the channels available and the sample rate but I'll leave everything as it is that's what I'm going to do so I'll just click on save and once uh, I'm satisfied our destination of this particular file I believe based on this is uh, our original folder. If you had only selected one file, then it gives you the option to set the destination. So I'll need to check this box to append a dash converted to the file name so that we can easily distinguish what file has been converted and what has not. So these are folder with the videos. Now it's, we can click on start. Once you click on start, you'll see something's happening down here. Just the timeline moving but it's the conversion process happening and it's done. If we look at the folder again here, you'll see that we now have new files with a converted name at the end. And these are all MP3 files uh, that have been converted 
from MP4 to MP3. When you look at the times, they're the same times as the original videos. So, what is the best free MP4 to MP3 converter in your opinion or maybe in my opinion? I believe it's VLC. Check it out from the link below. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I hope that you got a ton of value from this video. Thanks for watching.